Ivano Mines is pioneering new frontiers for minerals essential to sustainable life on our planet Earth. Our Tier 1 assets in Africa will be strategic, long-life suppliers of critical metals for future generations. Not only by supplying vital raw materials for the green energy transition, but also by transforming how mining is done with world-class ESG credentials. Kamor Kakula Copper Complex is the world's fastest growing, lowest carbon intensive and highest grade major copper mining operation. Phase 1 of Kamor Kakula commenced production in May 2021, on budget and several months ahead of schedule, after 30 years of effort. 12 months later, Kamor Kakula's Phase 2 expansion reached commercial production, also on budget and ahead of schedule. Kamoa Kakula reported production of 393,500 tons in 2023, already confirming its status as one of the world's largest copper mines. The Phase 3 expansion, which is tracking ahead of schedule for completion in early third quarter 2024, will further increase production to over 600,000 tons of copper per annum. Kamoa Kakula's expansions are funded by cash flows generated from operations. The mine has generated over $3.6 billion of EBITDA in just over two years. The Phase 3 expansion also includes a state-of-the-art copper smelter, the largest in Africa, which is scheduled for completion in the fourth quarter of 2024. The smelter is expected to significantly reduce shipping volumes by producing 500,000 tons of copper anodes, reducing cash costs by approximately 20%. Kamoa Kakula Copper Complex is 100% powered by clean hydroelectricity, made possible through a long-standing partnership with Snell, the DRC State Power Utility. With hydropower and a new smelter in operation, Kamoa Kakula will improve its position as the world's lowest carbon-emitting major copper mine. We also recently announced the first copper shipment on the Lobito Atlantic Rail Corridor, a project supported by the US and the EU which took a third of the time of the existing export routes by truck. The copper growth story does not end there. Adjacent to Kamoa Kakula, Ivano is exploring for major new copper discoveries at its majority-owned Western Foreland Exploration Project. A vast license package of 2,650 square kilometers with the same underlying geology as the Kakula and Kamoa deposits. We recently reported initial mineral resources for the Makoko and Kiala deposits in the Western Foreland, the world's third largest and highest grade copper discoveries in the past 10 years, after Kakula. We also announced significant drill results from the new Kitoko copper discovery, including a drill hole intersecting 5.2 meters through it, grading 11.6% copper, similar in style to Kakula. Ivanhoe has now discovered close to 50 million tons of contained copper at Kamoa, Kakula and the Western Foreland, the world's greatest emerging copper district. Blood Reef is the world's largest precious metal deposit in development and one of the world's largest nickel sulfide deposits. Blood Reef contains over 150 million ounces of palladium, platinum, rhodium and gold in indicated and inferred resources. and over 5 million tons of contained nickel in indicated and inferred resources, more than the remaining Sudbury Basin in Canada. The Phase 1 mine is under construction and on track for completion in the third quarter of 2024. This will build the platform for multiple phased expansions of Platte Reef through the construction of Shaft 2, one of the largest hoisting shafts in the world. During Phase 2, Annual production is expected to be 590,000 ounces of palladium, platinum, rhodium and gold, plus over 40 million pounds of nickel and copper. It will be among the world's largest, as well as the lowest cost primary PGM producers, with a cash cost of approximately $500 per ounce, net of byproducts. Platt Reef will transform the South African PGM industry. At a thickness of over 20 meters, its remarkable ore body is approximately 20 times thicker than the average South African PGM mine, enabling Platt Reef to pioneer highly mechanized, efficient and safe underground bulk mining methods and provide highly skilled jobs. 
Ivano is restarting the historic Ipushi mine, which is the highest grade zinc mine in the world. In January 2024, Ivano Mines and partner Jekamin, the DRC state owned mining company, finalized a new joint venture agreement to return Kipushi to production. Kipushi is among the richest metal endowments on the planet, with over 12 million tons of resources at a grade of 35% zinc. As well as zinc, Kipushi was in the past one of the world's richest copper mines and also contains strategic metals such as germanium and gallium that are used in semiconductors and optics. Ivano has spent over 10 years restoring significant underground infrastructure to fantastic condition and mining of the big zinc ore body recently started. Construction of a new 800,000 tons per annum concentrator is well ahead of schedule expected to be completed in Q2 2024. Kipushi is soon expected to produce more than 250,000 tons of zinc annually, one of the world's largest zinc producers. Kipushi, like Kamuakakula, will be fully powered by clean hydroelectricity, aligning with Ivano's vision to produce green metals. Across Ivano Mines projects, we share a common goal to discover and develop a sustainable supply of future metals. With an unwavering commitment to environmental stewardship and our host communities. Our green future is made possible by the hard work of thousands of women and men at our projects in Africa.